is the uh, part two um, for n law Josie Bells. It's a little bit, will be a little bit shorter um, than the uh, the first lesson, um, but still a lot of stuff to go through, a lot more picking patterns. And with my uh, acoustic not being a cutaway, it makes getting down here very difficult. So hopefully you've got a cutaway when you're playing this. Um, as always, if you haven't already, please click the subscribe button and hit the bell for notifications. And let's hop in. All right, so the second part starts. Uh, same place that the first one does. So we've got our middle finger on the 12th fret of the E, uh, index finger on the 12th fret of the B, and ring on the 13th of the G. And we move up here and we've got our middle finger now on the 11th fret of the E, uh, index is on the uh, 11th of the G, and ring is on the 12th of the B. Now we jump all the way down here. Cool. Uh, so we've got our index finger is on the 14th fret of the E, and our middle finger is on the 16th fret of the B. Let me pluck those two. And we come back to that first, uh, first starting note there. So this move here, so index finger is on the seventh fret of the low E, and pinky finger is on the eleventh of the high E. And then we've got our middle finger on the eighth fret of the G. And this is how I play it. I, I'm not gonna say this is note for note how, how Trey plays it, but so you could pluck um, Pluck the, the E strings, then I'm hitting the G, going back to the low E, to the high E twice, so again yeah, I'm plucking the, the uh, E strings, hitting that G, to the uh, low E, to the uh, high E twice. So let's get there again. And this part is very difficult without a cutaway here. So I've got my uh, index finger on the um, 16th fret of the E. And on the 17th fret of the B. Now I'm moving my index finger to the 14th fret of the E, and my uh, middle finger is on the um, 16th of the B. And now <laughs> we're all the way down here. Um, so we've got uh, index finger here on the 17th of the E, and middle finger is on the 19th of the B. Not sure if you can see that there. And we go back here where we've got our uh, index finger again is on the 16th of the E and middle finger is on the 17th of the B. I'll try to do that again here. back to the okay, so I'll try to go through that slowly here. Sorry about that. Alright. Now we are back up 
up here. Sorry. So it's very similar to what we played in the first section, uh, the first lesson. Um, but this time, so again, we're hitting that open A string, plucking the B and the G strings as we're barring the second fret. Um, and, but we're not not hitting that any longer. So we've got our pinky finger that's hitting the fifth fret of that B string. Pulling it back off. And then we're going to that pull off on the third fret of the low E. And hitting the harmonic there on the uh, B and E strings on the fifth fret. Do that once and then we go through it one more time. And that's again, that's the same, same pull off we did in the first lesson. So we're on the fourth fret of the B. Um, so we hit the fourth fret of the B, open E, then pull off on the fifth fret of the B. Got our middle finger on the uh, second fret of the G. Um, index is on. I'm sorry, second fret of the D. Index is on the first fret of the G. We're plucking that D G B. The B is open. So. And then we end this by hitting the uh, open E's, open E strings, both of them. And that ends this section. So I'll try to get through that again here. parts. Thank you all very much for watching. Uh, please leave any comments, feedback below, and I'll see you again soon.